Hi. It is Monday, August 1. The eighth month of the 16th year. As I told you yesterday, uh, doctors called and told me to stop taking antibiotics. I slept like a baby last night. And I woke up this morning and I was just like lying in bed and I'm like, oh my God, this feeling, like I don't want to let it go. I didn't want to let it go. I just felt so rested and so tranquil and so normal. And I like, I guess I just didn't, I don't, I don't still know uh, like the full amount uh, of side effects that, that uh, antibiotics have because I like I know there's some and you know people talk about the nausea and and diarrhea and all this other possible stuff uh, I'm just gonna list the two grossest and then move on uh, but but I'm telling you like the la all of last week from Tuesday until yesterday I did not sleep well at all uh, but I still had very vivid dreams, so there is that. I had very vivid dreams last night. Uh, one about my dad and my dad's aversion to uh, the doctor that I went to see, um, which is not based in a reality that I know of, and uh, but it was very vivid and very real, like a real conversation with my real dad about a real doctor. And then I had a, a dream about a friend of mine who went to a Radiohead concert, but like, I don't know that he actually did in real life. And in the dream was bragging about how they started the show with uh, one specific track and they ended the show with another specific track. Now mind you, in the dream, the tracks were specific, and I have to look them up because I I can't remember it right now. It's like on the tip of my brain. But I'm not even that big of a Radiohead fan that my dreams should be like exclu <laughs> exclusively referencing the tracks that they open and close concerts with. So the dreams I've been having have these like specific details in them that I don't I can't comprehend. Uh, where they're coming from, or what's what's feeding that subconscious imagery. So that's that. I don't know. It is uh, again Monday, August one. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, I will see you tomorrow.